these are my observation on the American presidential debate that was done at uh, at the CNN headquarters 60 hours ago it's funny it is laughable while these people campaigning to be the chairman of now Yapong cattle dip Uh, I remember someone who was saying that um, it is between a person who can't be president and another one who did be a president. And I remember an, a, a Canadian saying, thank, a, a telling other Canadians that they should prepare extra bedrooms in their homes because they are going to have refugees running away from the USA. Biden had this ghost look, eh? even his style of walking was like a robot. Trump had a monster look. And um, <laughs> I remember, I can't remember what they really were arguing about apart from exchange of abuses. I remember Biden telling Trump that you are you are a sucker and such a loose loose uh, you are a sucker and a loser. Most of the time, Biden was inaudible. You could not hear him. He was talking as if was very sick. Uh, Trump used a lot. Of, I don't think there is any any sentence that Trump completed without using the word stupid. And then there was the question of January 7, and Trump tried to run away from it. But uh, Biden was reminding him that even his own vice president uh, disowned him about January 7, when they? They did what Genesee did to our parliament. Uh, he even told Trump that uh, over forty, over 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 sixty percent, over sixty percent of his uh, cabinet are not supporting him this time. There was a talk about convicted felon. Uh, Trump was trying to, to insinuate that uh, Biden's son is a convicted felon. And I would have advised Biden to use that opportunity to say that my son is not a candidate here. Uh, uh, we are only two candidates, and one of them is a convicted felon. You would have left it at that. Uh, Trump was asked that supposing he loses, would he accept the outcome? He said he will accept it uh, if only uh, it is free and fair. <laughs> Same wordings were used by somebody in Kenya before the last election. And I remember uh, him, Nani Biden, using the word there, you are such a whiner uh, that you can't accept defeat. But anyway, I've been watching presidential uh, campaigns for over 20 years from the time of uh, uh, Bill Clinton, and this one definitely was the most boring. Thank you.